It's -a me, Luigi. Gonna piss poor Mario back, Cal. Hang on. It's just rubbish. It's just fried. <laughs> Anyway, we're at Huddersfield Park Run this morning, so I thought we'd dress up as Mario and Luigi again because it's Huddersfield. Don't know what I'm saying. I'll do a video afterwards. Bye. Now it's Mario and Luigi. <laughs> See, this is me and Carl dressed as Mario and Luigi again, um, and Mandy dressed as herself. Uh, we're on the Mario Kart course. That's uh, what it's known as anyway. The Huddersfield Park Run resembles a Mario Kart course, and it really does. It's quite fun to run on. It's lovely to be able to see everybody uh, doing different parts of it while you're on one section. It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Anyway, I thought I'd do a bit of recording of it in this perspective because it looked like probably the most realistic Mario game I've ever seen. So that's where we're going for. Well, it went quite to my stride plan. I was supposed to do it in about 31 minutes according to power. And I think it was 28 I came in. So I ran most of it round with Carl because it just looked good with Mario Brothers. So I kind of just lost my way with it anyway, but I think it was just following him then. It tried tracking you then, just step in frame. <laughs> oh shit, hang on. Oh, I tell you what, I am loving this. It's not even the most interesting route. Out and back on the main road. Just everything feels great. Just how it should be. Happy. Well, I hope you saw some of that. <laughs> The accelerations went really well, to me. Can't wait to see what power I will put him back out. Can't see that when we get back to the car, because like my headphones and my head torch, I forgot my phone as well. <laughs> Not in the right good time today. Well, I am. Anyway, I'll see you when I get back home. We'll go through the uh, stats. So that was my easy aerobic run done with my um, accelerations. Sorry about the racket, if you can hear that, that's my dehumidifier. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, just helping out with the old damp patch up there. Um, so, I'm just looking at this now to see where I were at. <clears throat> excuse me. I thought I'd done my accelerations well, but apparently um, I didn't quite hit the power that I were expected to hit. Um, I did on the last one, so I got 95% power, 89% power, and then 101. Um, so, yeah. I think I know why. I think what I needed to do is to already be running and not sort of like start from a stop. <laughs> yeah. Apparently I can't get from 0 to 60 in 2 seconds. <laughs> but other than that, I'm happy with how it went. It felt really good, it felt really nice. Loved being back outside. Um, breathing felt alright. It didn't sort of... It wasn't hard to start with. I always find if I go for a run after like a period like I've had for the last few weeks, um, the first mile is always just... Mech, in uh, you can't, I can't breathe. I'm like, oh god. Well, anyway, <laughs> I did. I did well. It felt comfortable. I loved every second of that. Uh, 
I'm not even bothered I didn't remember my headphones. I'm not even bothered I didn't remember my head torch. I'm not bothered I forgot the phone. <laughs> all of those little distractions were just nice to leave at home in all fairness and just crack on and get that run done. So, yeah, dead chuffed. See what tomorrow brings. See you there. Hello, we're here at the track, KCAC. Uh, so, you know the sketch by now, can't take you on there. However, I'm going to do a little bit of a warm up on the streets first. I don't know if you'll see anything because it's so dark, but well, we'll give it a go. Um, so, tonight's workout is a warm up of 20 minutes. Um, I've got 12 minutes warm up and then two times one minute at 97 to 103%, um, and two minutes of easy after that and then i've got four so it's not too bad just four times two point uh, two minutes 50 seconds so nearly three minutes uh with two and a half minutes recovery so i'm guessing that's probably going to be about 500 meters actually thinking about it but we'll see who knows my power is going to be at 101 percent to 106 so that's just over like 5k effort uh cool down after that um and then back to the van so We'll uh, see you afterwards and we'll see how we get on. Well, here I am home, snuggly. It's past, just coming up to nine o'clock. Tea's just about ready. I'm nice and warm now in this big thing. <laughs> um, so anyway, just about the tonight's uh, training. Uh, everything is in the green. I hit all the power I needed to. So just roughly going through it. Um, the warm-up uh, were around about 11.27 pace. Um, the runs, <coughs> excuse me, sections, the four run sections, which were the two minutes 50 seconds, uh, were, they averaged, I'd say, well, it was like 6.58 and 7.07. So early sevens was the average for that. So that's good. Um Felt really good, to be fair. I could have pushed harder, but my watch were telling me not to. And there's a point to that. So I did what he said, did what it said. And um, yeah, I've come away from it feeling really positive. Again, I'm loving this. This is this is exactly what I needed in the first place. I'm kind of annoyed at myself for not doing this to start with. But do you know what? You live and learn. That's how we get better and we improve. So, And that's exactly what I'm doing. Um, we're going to get this done. We are going to be fast by Feb. How do? It's Friday. How good's that? Tonight's run is a nice, easy 32 minutes at um, 210 to 240 watts of power, which it anticipates is going to take, um, get me to 3.1 miles. So a nice little... 5k steady along i'm not going to take camera with me it's just pitch black out there and where i'm going to be running you won't see now anywhere hence the old torture row so uh yeah i doubt there's going to be any updates on this one because it's far from exciting um tomorrow we're doing a new park run for the nendy i forget i think it's rothwell so that should be fun um hopefully the weather holds out for us Anywho, better get this done and get myself into Asda because I've run out of things to eat. Oh, by the way, have you seen how tired I look? This week, I've not been able to keep my eyes open. I've literally gotten home after doing my run or whatever. And I've been exhausted at work. I've done my run, but they've been good. Uh, I'd had some food and then fallen asleep on the sofa. Woke up about 10, 10.30 and then just taking dogs to bed because I just can't function as a person. So I don't think today is going to be any different. And uh, hopefully the weekend will be a little bit better because I don't think I'm going to sleep through it all. Right, I better crack on. See you in a bit.
I am so tired right now, but um, I have something to do, which is... Okay, so 24 minutes at between 2.10 and 2.40, so nice and easy, although it never feels quite as easy on treadmill. And then I've got 10 seconds between 300 and 600 watts of power. I don't even know if I'm going to better get up to that in 10 seconds on the old tready, but we'll just blast it. It's just an up and down anyway, and then a minute and 50 cool down, or just taking it steady between 195 and 240. Got to do that uh, one, two three times and a nice five minute cool down so 35 minutes in total the dog wants to go out better let him out let's do this Done. So here we are doing the final workout of the week. It isn't the long run it should have been. I should have been doing just shy of 11 miles and that would have included six times one minute efforts like last week's, um, but just a little bit longer of a run. I was very tired. I got up late. Uh, I did my walking challenge this morning, had some dinner, and I've just been just not really with it all day. Um, I did go out to start the run, but when I went out, my usual parking spot where I was going to go from to make sure I got the mileage I needed to get uh, was taken. <laughs> so <laughs> I just sulked and came back home and thought I'll do it on the treadmill, which turned into me watching a TV show, getting to the end of that episode and thinking I'm just going to go upstairs and watch the rest of this because I'm just too exhausted. I'm not upset with myself. It's been a very productive week. I do feel like I've got some gains from it. Um, and so I'll just see what next week brings. Um, I'll not keep you much longer. You're just looking at me in my dingy little basement there. Um, if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop us a like and why not subscribe and see if I actually do get fast by Feb. Um, yeah, see you in the next one.